currently in London at the moment. I've had a few events to attend. I've been in London already, but I've not been vlogging. It's not just me. Craig is around, but he's just gone out um, to get stuff. But this is like our third time of coming back and in between we've been traveling. We went to Rome and we also went to Barcelona. But we've not had time to vlog literally, but you can watch the travel vlogs on the channel. Uh, but we've just been so busy and right now as I'm in London, I'm going to be quite busy or we're going to be quite busy. So um, I've just come back from two events, one with Victoria's Secret and the other one is with a new makeup brand called Code 8. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, and I got some Nigerian food because I was craving some. So I am going to go straight in and have some Nigerian food because I am starving. checked into the Radisson Blue Edwardian Hotel because Craig actually thought today was Valentine's Day so he booked a hotel stay and checked us in. What is wrong with you? I don't know. I thought it was Valentine's Day. Today is day. what? Today is the 24th of January? It's oh my the god. It's the 24th of January and it's not until February. He thinks Valentine's Day is the 24th of January. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, at least okay. we got. Do you not think it's Valentine's enough with these little cute chucky wuckies? Yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna be staying here for the night on our non Valentine's Day day celebration. And the hotel looks good. Just some stuff. And this is the view. Of the hotel looking out into Manchester looks quite nice that's the town hall over there town hall Manchester town hall all looks good Craig has gone out to go chill um, downstairs at the restaurant probably grab something to eat I'm gonna join him later I'm just sat here in the room I'm about to edit pictures oh my god for those of you who don't know I have started a creative studio it's um, a place where I can showcase my creative photography work so the brands can book me for brand content or editorial style content I have created a separate Instagram account for it that's called the couples edit I'll link it down below in case you guys want to check it out um, fantastic services which is a cleaning service actually scrubbed down our apartment oh my god and it was looking like when we first moved in so we created a makeshift studio in the apartment which we kind of like set up and take back down but we've been traveling for the latter part of um, 2018 so we've not had time to kind of like organize ourselves so it was very nice to have fantastic services <laughs> The picture is all done and edited, posted on Instagram. Um, I actually have a Lightroom preset that I sell on the blog that you can buy to edit your pictures. Um, but also, I'm super excited to share with you guys that I did a collaboration with um, a photo editing app which is great for mobile phones and I created 20 presets for them. Um, at, I think it's going for £3.99 and you get a pack of 20 presets. The app is called A Color Story. I will link it in the description down below and my preset pack is called Lost Stories. I say you guys should check it out. A variety of presets for any mood. Um, one thing I would say is that a preset is just 
a start to the editing process of an image you might apply it and it might not look exactly as you want it you have to tweak it maybe reduce the exposure if it's too dark you could bring up the shadows and the blacks there's a lot of things that you have to adjust to achieve the results that you want in a sense so i would say definitely check it out if it's retailing for £3.99 for my pack, I don't think that's too bad if you're going to get 20 presets that you can play around with. One thing I tend to do with my images is add a bit of clarity and you could add some grain if you want. So you can add a bit of clarity and saturation to help the images pop a bit more. One thing to bear in mind because a lot of people have been asking me, a colour story do not add clarity on the presets I've already taken but you can adjust it in the app by adding clarity yourself hopefully that makes sense super excited about this pack let me know what you guys think about it it's called lost stories from and it's called lost stories from a color story so now i'm gonna go downstairs to have dinner with craig and yeah that's it Good morning! We had a really nice time staying at the hotel and it's time for us to head home now. Um, yeah, I'm wearing this lovely dress that you guys have probably seen. You guys have probably seen when we were in, where did I wear this dress? In Lisbon. And a blazer from another story's dress, ASOS belt. We really love this belt, it's no longer in stock. It's from Kate Spade, New York. Um, that's it. I think I'm going to do a shoot downstairs in the restaurant because um, the weather's not so nice outside so I can dress like this. And I'm planning on staying indoors all weekend. We'll see how that goes. Um, yeah, we are packed and ready to head home to our apartment. <laughs> having some breakfast at the alchemist we've got um american breakfast waffle american breakfast some bacon <laughs> some, bacon. some <laughs> eggs an egg benedict some fake and bacon yeah and we're gonna eat now back to our photo shoot schedule doing the shoot in front of this vintage store and cameraman extraordinaire It's freezing. I'm wearing a oh god, what they call this coat? Anorak. No, it's not anorak. Detective jacket. No, there's an uh special gadget coat. How can I not know? So I'm wearing this yeah. Parker. Coat. Yeah, I think it might be. Wear um satin long sleeve top, pair of jeans, shoes and this cute little handbag that says on guard. That's practically it. Let's get on with the shoot. Look who we have here. Adana. Adana, Adana, Adana. Yes, honey. <laughs> Hopefully, the people who watch my channel also watch yours. <laughs> yes, they, uh, yes, they do. Yeah. Hi, guys. This is Adana. <laughs> yeah. Um, so we're here in, in London. Welcome to a, an evening in my life. <laughs> Actually, here in London. It's a, do you know what? You should be in the video as well. Yeah. Hi, guys. Hi from London. This is Adana. Madame Talbot. Okay. This is the first time we're meeting, so it's a bit. <laughs> But we've been chatting for a while online. For years. Yeah. For years, literally. Is it 2015? I'm not sure. Yeah, it's like for, it, Do you know what? It actually doesn't feel like this is the first time I'm meeting you. I know. I know, it doesn't. And then, do you know what? So I arrived. Energy. Wait, wait, so wait, I arrived and I was like, hey girl, <laughs> hey girl. And Anya was like, hi. I'm like, hold on, let me drop my bag. <laughs> Let's try that hug one more time. <laughs> Give me all you've got. And I, I literally I almost know. jacked out. I was like, hey! <laughs> she is so energetic. And I've not even had any drinks. Oh, 
Mimi. I mean, Mimi. 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 Look who's her name is! Hi guys! Look at that shit! Sorry, I'm coming like, it's raining! <laughs> oh sorry! Hi. I love vlogging us! Oh my god, you're doing a little story! This is so nice! Uh, yeah, cheers! Cheers! Wait, 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 wait! We're in London and we're staying at the um, artist residence, a really nice quaint hotel. Love all the aesthetics. Also love this dress, this new inn. I'll link it in the description box down below if you guys fancy getting it. Some old suitcases there. Nice fridge with all our luggage and all of that. Artist residence in London. A touch of the bee. The bee came with us from Manchester. Yeah. in London but this time I'm all by myself so I've got the tripod set up and I've been taking quite a few self portraits on that couch over there um, I'm staying at the Mayfair Hotel it is a complimentary space so thanks to the guys at Mayfair for having me um, the room is quite huge it's beautiful I see the setup coffee table TV look at all these space but my favorite bit is the bathroom is actually a bit but it's not my favorite bit it's massive Ooh, you can catch a glimpse of me over there um, currently in London to support Lorna who is also signed to my agent and she's launched a clothing line with a brand so I'm wearing one of her pieces at the moment, it's a nice dress, isn't it? Look at the dress, lovely. Okay, this is my favorite bit. Basically, this is the wardrobe. How huge is this? Quite huge. I mean, how huge is this place? Love it. Okay. I need to get ready, grab some food, then head out. On me dit que nos vies ne valent pas grand chose, elles passent en un instant comme fanes les roses. On me dit que le temps qui glisse est un salaud, que de nos chagrins il s'en fait des manteaux. Pourtant, quelqu'un m'a dit que tu m'aimes en. This is me back in London. <laughs> I might as well move down to London. <laughs> So Craig isn't with me again today, but that's fine because I was doing a lot of filming at Reward Style. Um, so that's been good. I was answering some questions about my style. Check out this nice pattern coat that I'm wearing. Ju with the snake skin dress that I wore the last time. I quite like this look. So yes, yeah, a nice look. I'm going to link all the outfits in the description down below. This is something I'll start doing in the vlogs. You guys can tell me what you think of this look, but I'm definitely feeling it. It's almost like the Matrix. And yeah, this is my hotel life. I am staying at the um, Melia Hotel. It's called the Melia White House. I don't know why, but it's a really, really lovely hotel. 
um, it's not a complimentary stay, I had to pay for this one because <laughs> it's Valentine's Day and everywhere in London was so booked but I absolutely love this hotel and my stuff is basically everywhere I need to edit, just done a self-portrait I'm a bit out of breath because I've been um, travelling with a huge luggage and here's my tripod for my self-portrait, stood on the bed, took some pictures, gotta put the camera away and start to edit people. Got stuff to do. Yep. And I have changed my hair to a uh, fringe, side fringe. I love this look. Love this look. This jacket is quite noisy. So if you're sat next to someone wearing something like this, it can be annoying. And it's quite warm. Perfect for the winter. Yay. <laughs> Le destin se moque bien de nous, qu'il ne nous donne rien et qu'il nous prend. 